Hey everybody, it's Jameson once again. And before I go any further, I'd like to say thanks to Chung for featuring me on the recent uh, Subscribers Confidential. Uh, I got a real boost in subscribers from that, so uh, thanks a lot. And uh, I guess my wife kind of agrees with you that I do look a little bit like uh, John Winchester. <laughs> Anyway, uh, I've been kind of absent a little bit for the last couple weeks or so. Uh, I've been kind of under the weather, and I've had to renew my driver's license. And because I have a Class A, I drive a uh, tanker truck for a living, I had to take a hazmat test. So I was, when I wasn't lying prone in bed sick, I was studying like mad for my test. So I passed, and I get to keep my job. So, haven't been doing much of anything. My uh, Dark Eldar, last five, still need to be touched up a little bit. And uh, my terrain projects are all in limbo because I just haven't been able to get to them. I did get a couple of cheap army men for that CD terrain project, and I painted them up a little bit more realistic looking, but uh, I don't even know if I'm going to get a chance to finish that one. So, that's kind of on standby and uh, not really a whole lot's going on. So this is just a kind of a little update. Um, of course, that doesn't stop me from buying stuff. Uh, some of you may remember from one of my earlier videos how I posted when I started getting back into this hobby. I immediately went out and bought a bunch of box sets, starter sets. Uh, I had had the third edition 40K set, but I went and bought Battle for Crags, Hold On, Black Reach, uh, Skull Pass and Island of Blood, and then recently off eBay I got the 5th edition starter set. So, not stopping there, I recently got the 6th edition fantasy starter set, which features Empire and Orcs. I got this pretty cheap, and everything is in there, all the models are in there except one, the Orc bo War Boss which I can always replace later. But uh, they didn't have any books, just the models and uh, the, the terrain, which I put together, a little more little cheap little cardboard terrain. So I got that. I got so many models, and I still haven't finished the bloody Dark Eldar, so I don't know what I'm going to paint next. I'm thinking I might do the Tyranids from Battle for McCrack next. I'm not sure, but I think it's what I do. Uh, another thing I won off eBay was City by the Silt Sea, which is a box set for the Dark Sun campaign setting put out by TSR before they went belly up back in 90-whatever. Uh, this was a set that I had tried to win six times, and every time I thought I had nabbed it, somebody outgunned me in the last few seconds. So this one I finally actually got, and I actually got it cheaper than some of the earlier attempts I had made. So I was really jazzed about getting that. That was the last Dark Sun box set that I needed, so that's complete. And another couple things I got as far as RPGs were the Warhammer, the current 40, 40k RPGs. Uh, Dark Heresy, Rulebook, Rogue Trader. And if you want to play Space Marine, Death Watch. Now, anybody who's looked at these books knows that these things are not cheap. They're like 60 bucks each. And there wasn't any way I was going to pay that much. So my wife actually gets these coupons for uh, borders. And uh, using that, I got like 50% off each book. So I got these a lot cheaper than sticker price. So I've been having fun going through that. But other than that, not really a whole lot new. Uh, I want to get back to painting and my terrain, but like I said, I've been sick. been laying in bed and then studying, and then work's been busy, and with the weather and these parts, it's been really crappy. And just find myself being pulled in a whole bunch of different directions. Plus, there's other things I need to do, other little hobby projects and other things I want to pursue. So, hopefully this weekend, i got a three-day weekend coming up here, I'll get a chance to finish these Dark Eldar up and maybe start putting together those Tyranids or something. I'm not too sure what I'm going to move on to next. Maybe I'll make a video about that. Who knows? So, uh, thanks again, everybody, for tuning in, and I'll see you next time. Oh, and stay tuned for uh, another video on one of my other 
side projects that I do other than wargaming. You'll see soon. So, thanks a lot. See you next time.